Thanks for tuning in, this is The Life of Miner, and in this video I'm going to share the hash rates power draw and overclocks mining Monero on my RX 5700 XT, so let's check this out. Okay, so I'm going to share my mining results mining Monero on my RX 5700 XT, and I do own the 50th anniversary edition. So the new AMD driver was released, it is called the Adrenaline 2019. Edition 19.9.1. Okay, so this is my test bench and it does idle around 40 watts. Now, for the miner I'm going to use, I'm going to use XMR stack version 2.10.7. So now, on stock settings, using one thread, I was averaging around 850 hashes, but my GPU itself was only consuming around 185 watts. Stock settings with two threads, I was averaging around 1,107.1 hashes. My GPU itself was only consuming around 210 watts. And this is pretty much the settings for stock settings. The core is at 2,100, voltage is at 1,195, memory is at 875, and the power limit is at zero. Now for the best efficiency and the max hash rate that I was able to achieve, I was averaging around 1,117.4 hashes, but my GPU itself was only consuming around 110 watts. And this is basically my best efficiency settings. I put the core at 1501. I put the voltage all the way down to 681, the memory at 910, and the power limit at zero. Now I did try testing out other miners. I did try using Team Red Miner and SRB Miner, but both of these miners did not work. These miners are actually not optimized to use the RX 5700 XT. Okay, so if you did want to compare the RX 5700 XT to other graphics cards mining Monero, it's definitely better than an RX 580. And it's a little bit worse than a Vega 56 or a Vega 64. And it's pretty much on par with the 2080 Ti. Now this actually kind of makes sense because the RX 5700 XT uses the new RDNA architecture, which uses GDDR6 memory compared to the Vegas, which uses the Vega architecture using HBM2 memory. And HBM2 memory is actually a lot better when mining Monero. All right, so thanks for checking out my mining results mining Monero on my RX 5700 XT. And I'll definitely be doing more testings down the road, so stay tuned. And check out my other videos testing the RX 5700 XT on other algorithms. Okay, so hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thumbs if you enjoyed it. Sub if you decided to see what's next. But of course, thanks for watching and always happy mining. Promise you'll catch me.